Hey dogs, where are the boys? Hey boys, where are you? Come on. Woo! Come on boys. Come on. Dogs and no rams. Come on boys. They can't have disappeared. Oh, you're in the shed. Hey, boys, come on. Out of boys, come on. <laughs> come on, boys. Come on. There's some tasty bits for you. Come on. Atta boys, come on! Woo! Come on! Okay, I'm gonna have to go and get a fake bucket. Got a selection of fake buckets collected over times so that I've dropped them. Let's see if the fake bucket will work. I wanna get the rams out of here to let this rest fully. Oh, there we go. We got one. Good boy. Here come the others. The fake bucket works. Come on, boys. Come on. Good boy. Brindle, leave her. Come on. Java. Come on. Come on. Come on, boys. Come on. Come on. Come on. Look, you know, I've got you a treat down here. I do have a treat for you, actually, in the shed down here. Come on. Yeah. Now, if you go in the shed, there's a treat in there for you. <clears throat> One. <coughs> there we go. All four of the boys are in, having their treat. Okay, I'm gonna let these guys into the orchard for a couple of days because the orchard lane really needs grazing. Yeah. Hey girls. Yeah, a little bit. You know the story. Hey, hey excuse me. You two know. last one alpaca hey java leave it well you two at least are on the right side i now have to catch an alpaca yeah i'm gonna go get your mother and your grandmother who's all the way gone up the laneway this is full of really good healthy stuff for the sheep dock with loads of tannins in them. Plantain is a really good mineral rich. And there's clover, white clover. And all kinds of stuff. So, but because I have one alpaca here. Oh, here we go. Are you going to come down with me? Yeah. 
Okay, let's, this way, if I, if you come out and I let you out, no, 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 I know, you want to eat those. Come on. We're going to put you out with your mother, your daughter and your granddaughter. Brindle, oh, blast. Brindle, would you behave? Little bit, no, you no, don't you go up. Brindle, no, you go up. Oh, blast. No, 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 no. Go back, go back, go back, go back, go out. Oh, Brindle, quiet. You be quiet. Okay, I'm gonna have to do this a different way because that is obviously not gonna work. So what I was hoping to do was just let the sheep in here to graze and then let them in the orchard. But because of you, I have to put them in the orchard. Is this gonna work? Let's try, second time around. I had to close the gate. Java, leave it. Hey, Oreo Bloom. Good girl. Good girl. Okay, now. Go out that way. Yay! Okay. Whew. Okay. <laughs> Little bit demanding I open the top gate. Not realizing there's tons of food right here. Okay, little bit. Okay, lady. Will I follow you and open the gate to the orchard for you? Is that what you're wanting? There's loads of grass in here. Look, there's even silverweed. Basically, she's telling me to come open the top gate. Whoop! She's being boss to Crystal. Hey, 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 Java, leave it. What I'm going to do, see, the those... Plum, scrub plums also are really good in tannins and minerals for them. So I'll just leave the top gate open. I've done the two gates so that the, uh, it's cool enough that I'm, I still have to shear that one. You know, I'm still not strong enough from having been ill. Ah. Look at you. With the cleavers all over you. Silly crystal. Okay. This yo, I still have to shear, but I still don't have the strength. Jeez, this thing is taking the stuffing out of me. They say it's a hundred day cough. Okay. You guys are gonna rush in there, but there's more food in the laneway. There's more food in the laneway than in the orchard. Brindle, leave it. Brindle, come back and leave it. Okay. So, Java, Java. They're gonna graze there. And then they'll come down and graze in here. I'm just gonna leave the, this gate open for them. Cause there's loads for them to eat in here. So they'll come back and eat this. Once they've eaten this, I've got to move the lambs to a new pasture and I'll put the yews where the lambs were. At least that's the plan. You were bold. All of you were very bold. Bold, bold, bold. On Twitter or X or whatever word you want to call it, I was talking about collecting seeds of poppies and somebody was asking me questions. Um, these are the seed heads of some of the poppies that I have here on the farm. And these are too green. You have to wait till they're brown and there's a little gap right up there between the cap and this. And when that opens up, you can then collect the seeds because then you just tip it over and pour it in. So these seeds, they, they've finished blooming and you can see it's all seed heads now. So I just wait until those are, um, brown 
and then I'll collect them and spread them somewhere else. Or birds will eat them. I mean, birds are welcome to eat them. I'm gonna take some and spread them elsewhere so that there's more seeds for other occasions. Like the dogs are eat all eating grass. They've got a well-rounded diet of fruit and grass and whatever I feed them. This is the dog shoot for skinny, tiny dogs. Can you hear the tree humming? It's full of bees. Bumblebees, hoverflies, honeybees, all kinds of bees. It's a lime tree and it's in flower. We have one, two, three, four, we have five lime trees here on the farm. They're magnificent for pollinators. Hopefully you can hear it humming. I've given the horses a bit of fresh grazing. So they came galloping over to see what I'd given them. This is just humming. Full of all kinds of pollinators. And that's just one of them, one of our lime trees. There's a meadow brown. There's a whole series of meadow browns. Look at that. They're a beautiful little butterfly. The field is full of them. There's one there. And then this one landed over here. And as I'm walking, they fly up and fly away. And then there's loads of these spider webs. Isn't that right? You guys are chasing them, aren't you? This is another lime tree. Humming, humming with bees and hoverflies. And see, there's a little hoverfly right there. It's a pretty little one. And then there's a honeybee. Can you see the honey? Oh, it flew away. There it is, honeybee. So the tree is humming with pollinators. This privet here smells absolutely heavenly. Like walking past the lime trees, there's a perfume that wafts in the air. It's the same with this privet, which a lot of pollinators like, but at the moment, the lime trees are their favorite. So there's a few flies on here, but not many pollinators. 
hoverflies and flies, but everything is out on the lime trees because they're in full bloom. But this just smells absolutely heavenly. <laughs>